up some. And we won't have to cry no more. Yep. Ah. Okay, so it is, <clears throat> I was about to say August. I don't know why I was going to say August, but it is April 24th, 2023, day five of me doing my um, 60 days conversation with God. And, um, so it happened yesterday I made my video in the morning and then so it happens after that um, so many lessons and so many things have occurred that day and um, I was just like he, oh God is always working he is always working so yesterday me and my son were going to the park and as soon as I step outside I see this beautiful black butterfly and I was just I just like oh my gosh I have lived here five years pretty much and I was like transformation instantly thought transformation you know god is walking me into a, a season of transformation and with that being said i was just like thankful because that was just confirmation that i'm on the right path so then um we went to the park his allergies was bad so we had to come home and my friend was supposed to come over and she was like Courtney, i was watching td jinx and i instantly thought of you and it says timing is everything and she was like so she sent it to me so she said um i want you to watch it so i sat there and i watched it and it took me a long time longer than expected to watch it because during watching it, i was impatient i was like come on get to the message like like you know i can't sit there for long it was an hour and 45 minutes and i was like come on and spirit was like here we go timing is everything and um i was like i was then you know starting to receive my the message that i was meant to receive from that sermon and recently spirit has been guiding me to, to leave it alone <laughs> leave it alone and because timing is everything and the seed in which spirit has planted in me and when the seed that which i have planted right he said leave it alone and it will come into fruition and the enemy knows what you planted the enemy wants you to get confused the enemy wants you to get frustrated and and dig it up because what T pastor td jakes was saying was the weed can grow next the weed can grow next to the wheat and they can grow up together right and what the enemy wants you to do is you take matters into your own hands spirit is calling you to do this but you're like no i got this let me let me do what i need to do let me pull up these weeds but not knowing that if you touch with the the seed that you planted you're going to ruin your crop you're going to ruin the um the harvest that is coming in for you and I literally just said, if you go back and watch my videos, everything is always in alignment. I literally said, God, put me back in the field, right? I said, let me tell these people who I am. Let me tell these people off. Let me, you know, let out my feelings. And Spirit said, no, let it go. Let it die. Let it be put to rest. The weeds will die because it is not feeding on anything. The weeds will not affect your harvest. That is a hard concept for me to grasp sometimes because I was just like, I was looking at it and it's like, I'm, I'm rushing it. I'm rushing. It's like, I don't see it sprouting, right? I don't see it coming in. And here I am going against God's wishes about to dig up my crops and it's not ready yet. Ruining all, every, all the hard work that I put into, all the um, nights I've, I've cried, all the nights that I, I've done the work. I'm about to dig it all up because of a timing issue. Our timing isn't God's timing. If it was too soon, it would be ruined. If I don't um, reap my harvest when it's time, it will be too late. Timing is everything. So listen to this. I had the notion last week, I said, I'm going to make me some bread. I never make bread a day in my life, but something was like, make bread, Courtney. Make bread. I said, I can make bread, <clears throat> please. Get the ingredients. Something goes wrong. I don't know what, I think I, something was like, add egg, add egg. And I was like, okay. And I was looking at the measurements. I was like, something doesn't seem right. Something doesn't seem right. I don't think it's going to come out how I, I want it to come out. So it was a failure. Cool. But within that... I wasn't paying attention to the timing. 
I was getting frustrated. I was not seeing the results that I thought I wanted. I, I wasn't seeing the results that I wanted to see. And even more so, Pastor Judy Jakes was like, even bacon takes time and everything has to be in a perfect timing. I was like, dang. When spirit wants to give you a message, they're going to make sure you get that message. And it just brought me back to like timing. I'm going to keep saying that timing is everything. It's a reason why I haven't been able to move. It's a reason why um, that specific thing that you've been praying for hasn't come into fruition yet. It's a reason why you were removed from that job. Because timing is everything. And I just seen a post this morning said, God doesn't take things away and not give you better. That's it. Whatever was taken from you, you're going to reap back tenfold. That harvest is yours. That blessing has your name on it. Don't rush it. Don't rush it. Work on managing that. You know that blessing is coming in. You know your harvest is coming in. Protect that. And let it go. Let it go. Spirit is like, court, be still. Things will be revealed to you. You will see things. Be still. Don't react. And I have been tested so much lately, and I'm, I want to react. I want to react. I want to get upset. I, I, I want to show people my anger, angry side. And Spirit's like, I, no, no, it will take care of itself. In this season, I am telling you to focus on X, Y, and Z. These 60 days, your harvest will come in. Perfect. Listen, another lesson. I was watching, I was watching TD Jakes on my TV and a TikTok notification came up. And it was a girl that I stitched her videos two months ago. And the date on that video was um, 2-21, right? And when I seen that video uh, yesterday on 2-23, it was exactly like 61 days, right? What mission am I on right now? 60 days conversations with God. And it was talking about um, focusing on yourself and um, everything is going to come, come into fruition. Don't worry about... Um, the outside factors, right? And again, it ties into time and everything. The Spirit is literally just telling me to relax, to chill. Don't worry. Don't stress. Keep focusing on you. Keep doing what I'm asking you to do, and it is all going to work out. And I was so amazed. Like, I had to search her video again. I was like, oh my gosh. Like, it's so ironic because now I'm 60 days ago, applies to 60 days today. So what does that mean? Timing is everything. She didn't come back up on my page for a reason. She didn't decide to repost my video for a reason that specific day. Timing is everything. It was what I needed within that moment to show me further confirmation on what spirit is guiding me to do. If I would react right now to the things that I know spirit told me not to react to, I would, I would destroy my harvest. I would... I would destroy it because that's what the enemy wants me to do. They want me to cause my own demise. They want me to go ahead and pick up at the weed. They want me to um, dig because once I dig at the, the, at the weeds, I'm digging at my harvest because sometimes you can't even tell the difference. You can't tell the difference. Roots are roots. So, I'm learning that spirit guides us. Spirit knows. Just like the enemy knows. The enemy's waiting, like slithering in the grass, just waiting for the perfect timing to trigger you. <laughs> and that's what I've been. I, thank you, spirit. I have said for the past couple of days, I have been triggered pissed off, triggered. That is nothing but the enemy. <laughs> that is nothing but the enemy. And I am at all 
because how fast this is moving, how fast this is going. Spirit makes no, no mistakes because timing is everything. Everything happens in divine timing. It doesn't happen on my timing. It happens on God's timing. Because I don't know what it takes to bring that into alignment. I may want that job as a CEO, but guess it, but there's already a CEO in place. Guess what? Spirit has to put an alignment for that space to be opening. And what does that do? Take time. Some of us are focused on, on, on relationships. And I've seen a, a, a TikTok post where the young lady said, it was in the Bible, it says, he is not fully yours until you give him back to, the, back to God and allow God to work on him. Divine timing. Because if somebody was meant to be in your life and they come in too early, it's not going to come into fruition. It's not going to work. There are things that people have to work on. There's um, aspects in people's lives that they have to let go of. When spirit is telling you in this season of loneliness, in this season of singleness, I am working on you. I am transforming you. Trust me. You you see everybody else in happy relationships. You see everybody else getting married. You're like, Spirit, when is it going to be my time? Don't worry when it's going to be your time. It will be your time. But for right now, baby, I am preparing you for your season. I am preparing you for your harvest. He's like, rest assured, you have everything that you need. I, I do. I have everything I need. I... Um, I have everything I need. What don't I have? A, a, a man, right? But it's like, but do you have love? Yes. You have love within yourself. You have love within your families. You have love within God. What are you looking outside of yourself for? Timing is everything. I don't even watch Pastor T.D. Jake. So when my friend said that to me, I knew that was nothing but God. And the fact that she didn't come over that afternoon made my butt sit down and watch that entire video. And I'm so glad I did. And at the very end is when the message really got good. Because if my anxious butt was going to skip through it and just try to skip through the parts, I would have missed it. I would have missed what was meant for me. Divine timing. Don't rush the process. Enjoy the process. Learn the lessons that are meant to be learned so you can um, reap your harvest. Reap what you sow. That hard work is coming. Your harvest is coming. I know mine is. And I just thank Spirit. I thank God for transforming me, for allowing me to do this in this season. All right. Timing is everything. Don't forget, can I, something, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment, leave me messages, comment on my posts. I love seeing y'all comments, um, how y'all feel about these things. Um, it gives me motivation as well. So I'll see y'all tomorrow.